are shut down again today. Thousands of teachers and support staff are crowding the state capitol right now fighting for funding. I'm Michelle Lynn. Things got heated today as the acting House Speaker asked troopers to remove teachers who were chanting. Let's listen. Members. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, the House will come to order. If the sergeants and the troopers will please clear the gallery. The sergeants and the troopers, please clear the gallery. We've told you teachers are asking for more funding for education. In just the last 15 minutes, we learned Union Public Schools will be closed again tomorrow. We have live team coverage on the school shutdown crisis, beginning with Fox 23's Preston Jones. He's live outside the Capitol with what the Oklahoma Education Association says must happen to end the walkout. We're talking with the OEA president this morning. She says that they are not backing down. That's also the song the band was just playing out here. Take a look at how many people are here holding signs again today. Thousands of people outside the Capitol. Uh, there is a very long line of people trying to get inside. The goal today was to have as many people inside the Capitol as possible talking with state lawmakers about the issues. The OEA standing strong saying that they are still pushing for funding for uh, classroom education, getting money for the teachers inside the schools, inside their classrooms. A lot of people gathering out here, though, because they just can't seem to get inside. The president of the OEA says that if state lawmakers think that people aren't going to keep showing up, they are wrong. And, and so they're talking to their legislators, and now it's one in, one out, because it's so full in there. Yeah, so again, just lots of people out here. You can see all of the signs of people lining up uh, from Shawnee, from all over the state. We've been talking with teachers from Claremore, uh, as well as Tulsa, Jinx, Union, every district in the Tulsa Metro. Teachers are out here from what we can see. So we're going to stay out here, keep talking with people. We'll check back in in the next half hour. Live in Oklahoma City, covering news that matters. I'm Preston Jones, Fox 23 News.